Okay, so each side has their own advantages and disadvantages. Um, the North had quite a few really great advantages. Reason number one, they have Abraham Lincoln, who is an incredible leader. He's great at pulling in people from all different like um, sides of this political spectrum and getting their opinions and getting them to work together. Um, he is a very great speaker, and he's great at like rallying people to his cause. So incredible leader in Abraham Lincoln. The North also has a stronger military because they are the United States of America, so they have the United States Army. So they've been trained, they know what's like how to fight, they have a navy, they have like tons of supplies. Okay. Um, obviously, the people in the army who are from the southern states aren't going to join and fight for them, but they still have the backing of the United States Army and those, um, like that part of the military. The North has more money. Because if you remember, once again, going way back, the North has all the factories and has all the industry and they have railroads, they have factories, they can produce things like that. They can just get it out real fast. Okay, so they have all these great things going for them and they have a lot more money. Now, some disadvantages of the North, though. They aren't necessarily fighting for a cause. Like, yeah, some of them wanted to fight to get rid of slavery, but most of them are fighting because the president asked them to go fight to save their country, to keep the country together, okay? Um, but they aren't quite as dedicated to the cause as the South is to get their cause, okay? Um, while So the next thing, while I said that they had uh, the military backing them, the military officers, like the leaders in the North, weren't as aggressive and they were not as experienced as the military um, like leaders, like the captains and colonels and those things of the South. The South had a little bit more, um, their leaders had a little bit more experience, but yeah, so the North wasn't as aggressive, which kind of hurt them for a little while. Also, most of the fighting of this war took place in the South, so that means the people in the North were not as used to that area. They don't know the territory as well. It's a little bit hard for them. Okay. 